on the Nigerian government, groups and individuals have continued to commemorate the 16 days of activism with various activities to create awareness on the need to end gender-based violence. One of such is Tak, a work, is Tak walking a mile in her shoe with survivors of gender violence encouraging victims to speak out. Basi Itaipan reports that this time the men took the lead. Walking a mile in her shoe, organizers say, aside enabling men feel what she feels when violated, portrays one message, together we can end violence against women. We are walking a mile in her shoes because we want to prevent all forms of gender-based violence and then also get pe the community more involved in reporting gender-based violence. Work is for many other women like Eunice, who for three years was in a violent relationship but could not speak out. I blame myself really for not speaking up. I would have died. And I also want to implore everyone, both women and men, please speak up so that you don't become history tomorrow. Speakers at the forum say gender-based violence is a threat to social development of the women and girls and economic development of the nation. It's a societal issue, but first and foremost, it's also a personal issue. And every individual should do what they can to make a difference. It, it is a common practice that needs to end. You see it? See it. The forum acknowledged that the men are also violated as records show that one in every three women and one in every 20 men experience one form of violence in a lifetime. Basi Taikbang, NT.